In this video, I will give a quick introduction to HH Timing. I will show how to create a new project, import a data file, and create some basic controls. The latest version of HH Timing can be downloaded from our website. The software is installed by running setup.exe in the downloaded zip directory and following the on-screen instructions. When the software starts for the first time, you will see the project management screen. On this screen, you can create a new project. Projects in HH Timing are used to store all of your configuration information and session data. Enter a name for the project and let it save in the default location. Click OK. We are now in the main workspace of HH Timing. At the top is the ribbon bar, which is used to control the software. On the left is the project tree, which is used to access all of the information saved in the project. In this example, I will import a CSV file from the WEC Alchemel website. In HH Timing, select Import TNS Data from the ribbon bar. A window will open. Select Alchemel as the file format and select Race as the session type. Finally, select the CSV file we just downloaded. Click OK and the import will start. Once the import is completed, you will be notified. You can see that the session that was imported is now stored in the project tree. I will rename it so that, so that it can be found later. Now that this session has been imported, it is active, as shown by the bold text. To load data for a different session, I could select Activate Session from the ribbon bar. To look at the data for the session, I can create displays using the ribbon bar. For example, a scoreboard. Cars and drivers are automatically created in the project based on the imported data. Their configuration information can be changed in the car options display that is open from the components tab of the ribbon bar.